pause to try to take him down because of that patented guillotine. It's so truly a case of pick your poison with this Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jamar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Three years apart, with big differences in height, but a similar reach. To get us started Ladies with the official introductions, Bruce This Bubba. is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out O2 Arena in London, England, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of seven wins, five losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Mickey Gall! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so the UFC is back at the O2 Arena here in London, England. The adult beverages are flowing. And we're going to feed off this crowd tonight, as usual, here in the UK, BC. You know, a lot of times you sit next to the octagon, and because we wear these headphones, you can barely hear it. But when we come to London, headphone or not, you are going to know that these people are loud, they're raucous, and they're ready to put on a show. They're ready to also cheer hard for the English fighter. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, huge block. Liver kick, big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, tags him with that money left again. How good is this action about a minute in? I think I'm gassing out just watching this thing. I'm exhausted trying to call <laughs> all the strikes that these two men are throwing at each other. What a fun fight. Yeah, hate to be the punch counter tonight. <laughs> Real sneaky body kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Punch is blocked. Oh, as good a counter striker as there is in the game. Straight right is good. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and he caught the kick. Nice straight punch. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Overhand punch. 
punch to the head, blocked though by Lee. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Slips. He is all about that left kick to the body. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. That right hand hurt him a little bit. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Good stick. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Big body kick. Just misses there with the left. Counters now, left hook to the head, lands. Just a slip there. Back and forth we go here. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Right punches there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Big punch lands through the middle. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by goal. Trying to establish that jab once again. Hands high, hands high. Big kick lands. Gall's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Nice body kick. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Keep your hands up, use your footwork now. It's okay. Use your footwork. Shot to the body, turned back by goal. Final seconds of round one. Nice loop and punch. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Goal gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Got clipped with the right hand. Goes back to that left kick once again. Throws the right hand there. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offering. That shot blocked by Lee. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Gall's got a big bruise starting to form on the right side of his body. Big body kick lands. Wild attempt with the right hand there. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Oh, he hurt a bad with a jab. Oh! 
Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Oh, that right hand is on point. He looks like Pac-Man. He's taking so many strikes to the head. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Goal gets caught with that punch. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. My goodness. Oh, big left hook there. He blocks the punch. Hands higher, hands higher. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Big punch land. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Oh, beautiful right hook counter. That punch no good. Ball's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Straight right hand now just misses. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. That was stuck in. Nice strike. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Nice. They continue to exchange. Nice kick. Leg kick. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Straight right, he misses. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Uppercut attempt does not get to the target. Nice job defensively there by goal. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Not there. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Just missed with the left there. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Just misses with the jab there. Hook attempt now blocked, though, by Lee. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Pretty good right hand. Oh, well done moving the head there to slip that left hand. 
Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, that's a nice strike. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Gall gets stung by that leg kick. Trying to find the range to counter with that kick, but misses there. Just misses with the jab. Three minutes to go in round three. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Great punch. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by goal. Strong defense there to block the shot. Just out of range with that right hook. Nice head kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active. his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. was coming high, and now he's got a hurt bad. Big head kick. Nice punch there by Gold. Beautiful right hook counter. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Hands on your face. Lands flush with that right hand. <laughs> nice job landing the double jab there, DC. I mean, you are definitely pressing that one. You love that one, don't you? You love that jab. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Gold. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice in size. This guy today is looking at focus mitts in his opponent. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Well, missed on that one. 20 seconds left. 15 seconds remain in the round. Nice punch lands over the top. Final seconds here. Lance with the right hand. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Straight punch lands. Try to establish that jab. Ooh, blocks the shot. 
Back to the overhead. Nice leg kick lands. Over and over, same story. Punch after punch to the head. Wow. Nice punch there. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Gall gets kicked, and once again, target area of the body. Back and forth we go! Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head in MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! Nice punch, Lance. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Right hand on point. Oh, combination lands. You gotta talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. Man. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by goal. Ooh, big shot lands. Beautiful body kick lands right under the other. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. That's a big strike right there. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. He missed with that jab attempt there. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Slips to avoid the right. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Goal strike attempt there is blocked. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Head kick attempt, unable to find the target. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Big head kick lands. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Some nice back and forth action here. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh. What a round. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future Ready? champion in the making. Ready? All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets up. Yeah. This fight's gonna be over this year. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out.
Dog gets caught with that punch. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He got it! Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're gonna find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore...